Ik heb een aantal Europese vrienden uitgenodigd om hun verhaal met ons te delen. Kijk je mee? Hi, I'm Zoe and I live in Sheffield in the United Kingdom. I was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis in 2013 when I was 27. But actually I had been experiencing symptoms since I was 16. So I waited for my official diagnosis of MS for about 11 years. Um, I didn't tell my family that I had MS straight away. And I think looking back that this was because I wanted to protect them from the worry. Um, I also wanted to learn more about MS myself before I shared the diagnosis with them because I didn't know very much about it myself. I don't think I'd do that again now because it meant that I didn't have much support around me during that really difficult time. Um, so I wouldn't necessarily recommend that was the best course of action for anybody, um, to be honest. O meu nome é Thelma Teles, sou portuguesa e tenho esclerose múltipla desde 2015. Sei que na altura que fui diagnosticada, falei de imediato com a minha família, que me deu o maior apoio do mundo. Falei com alguns amigos meus, mas acima de tudo, falei também com o trabalho, para lhes dizer que realmente eu tinha alguma coisa de grave. E também me deram apoio. Quando o meu marido foi diagnosticado com a esclerose múltipla, contámos mais uma vez com o apoio fundamental da nossa família, ele falou com alguns amigos mas mesmo esses amigos foram-se embora. Uma coisa é certa, desde que nós fomos diagnosticados com a esclerose múltipla, estamos muito mais unidos no nosso amor e, sem sombra de dúvida, com a nossa família. Falar é importante e o outro lado, ter sensibilidade para nos dar carinho, ainda é muito mais importante. Slot heeft Owen uit Ierland nog een mooie boodschap voor ons. Bedankt voor het kijken en tot snel weer. Doei! Mijn naam is Owen. 35, Dublin, Ireland. Nice evening. Uh, I was diagnosed with MS 10 years ago. When you're diagnosed with MS, you begin your first care journey to the hospital with as a normal person and with nothing especially remarkable about yourself. And then, on the way home, having been given your diagnosis, you make your second car journey back to where you were before. Change forever. And then one day you'll realize that there are many more journeys waiting in front of you. With or without what has happened, you are as you were before. So, if you have been diagnosed like me, then remember it's not the end of the world. Working on the cure, uh, yes, yes we are. I have a video about it on my channel. You can take a look, should you need to. And remember, don't forget your joy. Perfect is boring. Wisdom is only useful when it's hilarious. And you'll be fine. Thank you for joining me.